I didn't see there. Today we're going to talk about types of characters. The first is a protagonist. This is who the story evolves around. They are not always the hero of the story, and they are usually the main character, but they're not always the main character. Antagonist. This is the character who acts against the protagonist, so they're sometimes seen fighting against the protagonist. They don't always have to be the bad guy, though. A round character. These are characters who are fully developed. We know how they look, how they act, what they say, what they think, and what others think about them. They are often the main characters. An example of a round character is Gru from Despicable Me, as he reveals many emotions throughout the story. We see him as an overprotective father, we see him want to steal the moon, we see him fall in love, we see him be smart to come up with evil plans, we see him be jealous of other villains, and we see him try and leave behind his life of crime. So we see many emotions of him in the story. A flat character. These are characters who are not fully developed. We only see one side of them with very few traits. They are often secondary characters. An example of a flat character is Benvolio from Romeo and Juliet. He remains unchanged throughout the play. He is temperate, solid, and loyal. He always tries to maintain peace and harmony between the two families. Benvolio's purpose is, is to support Romeo to get married to Juliet, so he's not the main character. A static character. These characters don't change. They are the exact same at the end of the story as they were at the beginning. This is because they often don't learn from their experiences. An example of a static character is a stepmom from Cinderella. She is mean at the beginning of the story as she is at the end of the story, so she doesn't change at all, making her a static character. A dynamic character. These characters change over the course of the story. They may shift their attitude or completely turn around their life. They may change their path in life, but not always for the better. An example of a dynamic character is Shrek. He learns to love and to let other people into his life. He doesn't want his life to be just him anymore, like it was at the beginning of the story. Now the question for this video is who is your favorite character from any book, movie, or TV show?